Hello! In this tutorial, you'll learn the basics of using your remote control. For this session, we'll be using the Intone remote, which is black and looks like this. We'll also be using the Intone 455 Whole Home DVR box, which looks like this. The most common problem we see with using the remote is which device button to press first. To turn on or off your TV, simply press the TV button once. The TV button on your remote will light up red when pressed and will go off when released. Press the power button on your remote control once and the TV will turn on. Of course, pressing the power button again turns the TV off. To turn on or off your Intone DVR or set-top box, press the STB or set-top box button once. The STB button on your remote will light up red when pressed and will go off when released. Press the power button on your remote once and the set-top box or DVR will turn on. Of course, pressing the power button again turns the set-top box off. You'll know that the set-top box is on by the blue power light illuminated on the front of the set-top box. If the light is gray, it means that the set-top box is off. So remember, select the device that you want to control and then press that button once on the remote. You are now able to control that device using your remote control. The next step in using your remote control is changing channels on your set-top box or your DVR. With your set-top box device selected on your remote, there are three ways you can change channels. One, by pressing the number buttons. Two, by pressing the channel buttons up or down. Or three, by making channel selections using the guide button. Note that when you press the number and channel buttons up or down, the info bar is displayed at the bottom of your TV screen. The info bar provides information about the current channel selection. To select and change channels from the guide, just press the guide button once and the guide screen appears. Remember to press the STB button once on your remote to make sure that the set-top box or DVR device is activated. To select the channel from the guide, simply press the directional arrow buttons. These buttons allow you to scroll through each channel. To bring up the next set of channels or previous set of channels, simply press the channel up or down buttons. To make a channel selection, just press the OK button. Press the exit button once and the guide will disappear from the screen. Note that when you press the guide button more than once on your remote, you're actually toggling between favorites lists, such as all, subscribed, HD channels, pay-per-view channels, and any other custom favorites lists you create. Creating a favorites list allows you to build a channel listing of the channels that you watch the most.